Hello everyone, Robert Rambles here, and welcome back to World of Warcraft, the Burning Crusade Classic, and our Torrent Warrior playthrough. Today we're tackling uh, Old Durnhold again, in the Caverns of Time. This time we have a level 70 Paladin on heals, 67 Mage, a 67 Hunter, and a 67 Troll Druid. We're waiting for one of our groupmates to finish the little walk-around escort quest in the Caverns of Time to open things up. But we could probably pull uh, while we wait for them. They just finished the quest, so they should be here pretty soon. Now, I'm pretty sure there is a patrol that works its way through here. Uh, I'm going to keep marking everything so that we have a kill order. The guys over here to the left that we probably don't need. I'm going to pull these guys back. Are they going to shoot at me? Yes. Yes, they are going to shoot at me. So, we can't pull guys back. Got it. Alright, uh, we got detected from quite a ways away. Couldn't get a charge off there, that's okay. And it looks like our hunter buddy has caught up to us here, so now we have the full group assembled, which means we can continue working our way in. I'm gonna go this way. Now these guys, I would love to pull them back. I'm just kind of worried about this not being line of sight, uh, the edge of this building. We can try it and see but I think they're going to come with more than just the two of them. Yeah, see, we ended up getting everybody to come out here. I haven't figured out a good way to tackle these pulls yet, honestly, uh, because it looks like no matter what, we're getting about four enemies. Which could be okay. Uh, but it could also be really bad. It's going to depend on a few things. I also am going to have difficulty marking them through the inside of the house. I guess I should make sure everything inside is marked before I pull the guys at the door. I already tell by the DPS going out that this is going to be a much more balanced run than the last time we were in here. We had a level 70 mage who was completely decked out in gear. And uh, pretty much just ran through the place really easily because of that. Which is not typically the type of experience that I want. I like to have some kind of challenge and not have a DPS class able to run us through completely. This is already feeling a lot better. Alright, someone has to go click on the barrel. Um, hopefully enough of us, as in everybody, grabbed their explosives to do this. 
gonna mark you and you. Can I see anybody in here? I'm gonna mark you for a third kill. And I'm just gonna tackle this assuming that uh, we're gonna pull everything. These guys are aggroing from so far. Thought we were good there to set up a charge, but that did not happen. And there is a fear. Luckily there's not anything else around in this area that we can get feared into. That won't always be the case. No barrel inside of this one. Make sure everybody has the mana they need. Ah, uh, I really need like one more second. Count to four, give me a four count. If there's four mobs, give me a four count and by then I should basically have a Sunder up on everybody. But it gets really hard to get a bunch of snap aggro when all I really have to do that is thunderclap and thunderclap does not deal a lot of threats thunderclap does not deal a lot of threat and I can't spam it it's on a four second cooldown so really need to be able to get a devastate off on everybody before big AoE start going out preferably Alternately, I could run a little bit ahead before the DPS is ready, and I could do that to get threat ahead of them. Which is not a tactic that I like to use, but I will. If it's gonna make the pulls a little bit safer. Alright, that looks good. Going here next. And we can expect that inside there's going to be two more guys. So, oops, we'll mark it there. I'm surprised we got that through the wall. Like, that guy just took off. Didn't have a chance to tag him or anything. I don't want to turn my back on these guys to uh, get a taunt off, really, but I'll try to work our way back here. Didn't really seem to matter. I'm going to let that one go, let the hunter pet take care of it. Seeing a oh there it is it looks like we already got it perfect okay moving on
All right, well, so far everything is going surprisingly smoothly. I think we have to hit the last barrel here. All right, there we go. Bombs set, five out of five. Let's come up here. We're going to have a boss rundown in a second. Here he comes. I think he's going to run all the way down to the bottom no matter what we do. Yep. You there! Fetch water quickly! Get these flames up before they spread I to the rest of the keep! And I mean Hurry, to put an end you. to it! Permanent. not stand in the whirlwind. No reason to do that. Run, you blasted cowards. That's a nice fear. It's a pretty long fear, too. Well, that's the whirlwind again. Some plate with uh, strength, stamina, and intellect on it. Not what we need. Mana per five. Maybe the paladin needs those, but I doubt it. He's level seventy, so odds of him needing those needing those is pretty low, I think. No, he he rolled on him. Well, that's good. I like to see people actually getting loot that they need, uh, even when it's not us. This is all going to pull together. I don't know if I want to charge it or pull it back. Okay, into the keep we go. We've got a patrol here that I'm gonna let come all the way out. Maybe we can get him by himself if we do it this way. As for this next part... I think for this part we are going to be charging in here. And there's the fear. Luckily, we've already pulled everything here anyway. Oh, 
Um, whoa, 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 whoa. What in the hell? All these guys just evaded and reset. They evaded and reset. I wonder why. That is incredible. But they didn't reset back to their starting positions. They, they kind of started like out here in the hallway. Very, very weird. Uh, I dislike that. It also looks like when they reset, they they dropped all threat. Also not very good. Luckily we were able to get it. Everyone is really low on mana now, though. Hmm. Very weird. We're still in combat. Is there a runner that's just, like, out here somewhere? Did he just get away and now he's off in the abyss? This is kind of nuts. Um, okay, we're not in combat anymore. Yeah, very, very weird. I don't, I don't know what happened there. Hmm. Well, we can hope that we don't see any more glitches like that. I don't know if it's a glitch. It's not a bug. Worst game ever. Yeah. <laughs> One bug. Worst game. Uh, do we, do we have the ability to get you out? Did nobody... Who has the key? Yeah, I don't seem to be able to let him out of here. Who are you? Just leave me be. Okay. Hmm. Okay, someone had the key. Okay, thank god. Very well then. Let's I was hoping go. we didn't somehow bug Thrall out. I'm assuming Thrall can probably tank one of these guys. 
but there's not really a, a great reason to let him do that. Oh my god, really? All the way back to the healer? Healer through? Oh, this is not a healer. This is a boomkin. <laughs> I, was gonna say, I saw green. My brain told me healing. Just ignore me. I know what's going on. Yeah, so far the pace of this run is a lot more enjoyable than the last one we did. Uh, that didn't work. We didn't get anywhere doing that. Thrall got sheeped. That's actually really awesome. Alright, almost time for the second boss here. I feel like the wardens can heal or something, so you didn't really think take them you would out first. escape, did you? You and your allies shall answer to Blackmore after I've had my fun. Uh, we got justice there, Hammer of Justice. And Hammer of Justice again. No holy light for you. Guards. Guards. There we go, that's what we want to see. Strength and Stam, much better than what we have. Well, better than what we have because of the sockets. We're gonna roll on it, that'd be a nice upgrade. And there we go, do we want to equip it before we can socket it? Uh, yes. Well, we'll be giving up parry. We'd be giving up parry. I'm probably just going to shove either a bunch of strength or a bunch of stamina into, into the sockets anyway. The resilience bonus is not really worth it to me. We'll equip it for now. And uh, we'll get it socketed ASAP. Maybe, I, but maybe I should leave this one on for now. It does have the parry rating. However, the new one has more stamina. I'm gonna take the more. I'm gonna take the health over the parry, and we'll get some crit strike. Is that the whole dungeon? No, that's not it. That is not the whole dungeon. I do have to say though, maybe the route is different than when I used to run this, but this does feel a lot faster than I remember it being all the way back in original Burning Crusade and after. This day is long overdue. Out of my way. Oh, I don't remember him doing this last time. He is not happy about these dudes on the road here.
they were not aggressive. Thrall has an instant mount. That's a fun button to have. Alright, to the farmhouse we go first. Did we lose him? There he is. Don't scare us like that, Thrall. Nothing happens in here, but guys will spawn on the outside, so let's come back out and uh, get ready for that. And no charging for us. Thought I could maybe get a charge off there, but it was not meant to be. Well, we've been stunned for a little while. And stunned again. Yeah, for some reason Thrall has to go back inside to like further verify that Teratha's not hiding in the barn. Okay, yeah, let's get a move on here, Thrall. She's not in there, man. Not a lot of places to look. It is a World of Warcraft building after all. It's not exactly elaborate on the inside, now is it? Yep, scope it out good. She's not here. No, no one's here, man. Oh, the stuns are bad. The stuns are very, very bad. Again, he runs back in to verify what he already knows, and then he runs right back out. <laughs> he has the AI pathing of a like a bad escort quest, basically. At least he runs, though. At least he doesn't walk the entire time. That would be painful. We're, yeah, these guys all spawn right up here. Don't stun me till I hit everybody, please. There we go. Yep, now we're stunned.
I could not get that one. Our shield slam was on cooldown, and I don't know if we have any other interrupts. I know the mage has counter spell. Don't know how many mages have counter spell out on their bar these days. But it is a nice to have to stop heals from going off and other detrimental effects. Or even just to stop a uh, damaging spell from going out would be great just to toss a counter spell. I know it eats into the DPS a little bit, but it's typically worth it to negate damage. life hangs in the balance. Surely no. you care for her. Surely you wish to save her. Ah, there you are. I had hoped to accomplish this with a bit of subtlety, but I suppose direct confrontation was inevitable. Your future thrall must not and so, you and your troublesome friends must die. Alright, that's all of the ads dealt with. Now I think he is going to come down next. Oh, we can skin these guys. I actually didn't know that. I'm going to try to keep him pointed away from the group. And there's some cloth healing shoulders. Yeah, really smooth run. I'm glad we did this a second time. We did get the chest piece that we needed out of here. That makes me really happy. A couple of other people seem like they got gear that they need as well. So that is always good. Yeah, really good run. 
And thank you all for being here and joining me today for our second Durnhold run. I don't know how many more times we're going to do this. There, there are a couple more pieces in here we could use, so maybe we'll do it once more. Three times is a charm, but we'll see. Thank you guys for being here again, especially if you made it this far into the video. You are a legend, and I greatly appreciate your support. Everybody take care of themselves out there and take care of each other. We'll see you back here again really soon. Bye now.